not in parallel world discovered, fully equipped. Oh, hey, mister, here's your paper. Intelligent beings, mighty the works. Read all about it. Hey, lady, here, have a paper. Excellent. Yeah, let me see that. Five cents, Pops. The name's not Pops. I just want to find out about this here parallel world. Uh, it's called Habitat, but cough up that dope, Pops. No playing games. Jimmy, the name's not Pops. Look, I promise I'll pay you as sure as my name is. <laughs> Valentino. Valentino? What's going on here? What kind of game are you playing, Pops? Pops and his friend Jimmy aren't the first people to get drawn into this strange new world where names can change as quickly as events. Surprises lurk at every turn, and the keynotes of existence are fantasy and fun, here in a place called Habitat. What do you teleport, boo? Boo! <coughs> where am I? And who in the heck are you? It is said that boredom once ruled the lifestyles of the avatars, the beings who populate this world. But recently, all that changed. With the birth of an alliance between powerful beings, both here in Habitat and in the human realm, and with the cooperation of a huge mainframe computer in Virginia. Now, using their modems and Commodore computers, people from Westport to Walla Walla can join Quantum Link and Lucasfilm on an electronic journey unlike any other. One that leads to Habitat, where thousands of avatars, each controlled by a different human, can converge to shape an imaginary society. Hey, listen, my real name's Henry. Uh, they call me Pops. I, I mean... No, thick wit. Henry's your human. He's just controlling you. Here you get to be someone else. Well, th th then I, I guess I really am Valentino. Talk about great expectations, lover boy. Now let me be a minute. I got some digging to do and some treasure to find. It is a place full of drama and adventure, a place where a thousand and one things can happen simultaneously, making the possibilities here positively unpredictable. So, rest assured, our Mr. Valentino will hardly be alone. Hot dog! A hole! For example, Sweldrella here is an avatar controlled by Luann Smith from Beverly Hills, here on a quest for high magic. And high magic is just what she's found, here in a land lies beyond her wildest dreams. A crystal ball. Oh, maybe it will take me away from this dull tropical paradise. What I want is adventure. Yeah, and, and what about me? Ask the Oracle. Sooner or later, he'll answer. I promise. Like many avatars, Sweldrella lives for adventure. And it's the great oracle, Habitat's resident source of wisdom and wizardry, who often delivers it. And although this crystal ball is just one of the magical vehicles of the oracle, it may be precisely the ticket she's looking for. Now stand aside, Valentino. I'm bound for adventure. Uh-oh. But powerful as it is, the oracle is only one source of action here in Habitat. Surprise! Because Sweldrella knows that it also depends on who she happens to meet, and then how she exercises her own power to shape her destiny. Hi! Wanna hit the hot tub back at my toy? Zapperty do da, zapperty day. <laughs> this is one of Habitat's newest recruits, an avatar named Young Turk. Back in Poughkeepsie, he's Conrad Klein, a lawyer with Klein, Kate's Kipling and Klein. And right now, he is choosing a new look that will reflect his real self-image, from toe to head. Obviously anxious to show off his true self. And to get on with his first excursion, Conrad Klein directs his alter ego avatar out into the meandering, unpredictable world of habitat where each and every environment connects to another. With nearly a thousand and one different places to explore, from forests, caves, deserts, and tropical paradise, to Popolopolis, the thriving metropolis. Hey, bud, wanna buy this key? Unlocks the secrets to the universe, it does. Fast action may be the name of the game for much of the fringe element in Habitat society, but Young Turk is after a different kind of action. His aim is to become one of Habitat's social paraparazzi, 
and to do some plain, old-fashioned networking. In fact, many an avatar will congregate simply to compare notes about the human realm, to keep up on Habitat current events, and to socialize. Say, I know. You're that guy Lamborghini from Detroit, aren't you? Oh, the name's Young Turk from Poughkeepsie. I like that better. Let's blow this joint. What do you say? Oh, took the words right out of my mouth. Habitat. It is a universe unlike any other, full of fantasy and the unexpected. Because you never know who you might actually wind up meeting in reality. Take Thornton, for example. In the real world, he's a columnist for the town crier in the seaside village of Nag's Head. Here, he runs the Habitat Gazette. Or Chelsea Sweetwater, who's run out of funds to redecorate her Boston mansion. In Habitat, she can change her turf as often as some folks change their radio stations. Then there is P.T. Warbucks, a merciless shopaholic. Like every avatar, he's endowed with a trust fund he fritters away his days with drawing cash tokens from his auto teller and spending it lavishly on trinkets in the vendor machine. Or Bob Beasley, who is the enterprising type. He has moved to Habitat to open a trivia shop where he sells it by the pound. And of course, Valentino, who's now found his calling communicating through the Habitat mail. In fact, there's more to see and do in the world of Habitat than any avatar or human could possibly imagine. Socializing, games playing, adventuring, shopping, selling, and sometimes there's just no telling. Funny, this doesn't look like Kansas, uh, I mean Habitat. Because each time a visitor re-enters Habitat, things might be just a little bit different. We're in a world based on the motto that behind every avatar there is an enterprising human can expect nothing but surprises. It's a place that will be shaped by the interactions of thousands of avatars, a place that constantly evolves. Even the mysterious Oracle will play his part as he creates new regions for questing. It all adds up to a whole new kind of entertainment and an intriguing world that's just plain difficult to leave. Lucasfilm's Habitat. It's a wonderful new place that's simply out of this world. Coming to life only on Quantum Link. <laughs>